I'm in the downtown district here in Warsaw around North Front Street. It's been a, the historic register of historic districts since 1996. It's a rural town, Warsaw is, but it's far from secluded. US 117, a major highway, runs through the heart of town connecting Wilmington and Goldsboro. Interstate 40 also runs through the west side of town. It is a small town, but there's still plenty of reasons for you to visit Warsaw. Life doesn't quite move this fast in the Duplin County town of Warsaw. That's not to say things aren't lively for the about 3,100 people who call this place home. In 1838, the present day Warsaw was laid out into lots along a new rail line that ran from Wilmington to Weldon in Halifax County. Today, that same rail line runs through town. You can find history all around Warsaw. The Warsaw Historic District was added to the National Register of Historic Places in 1996. The district features 56 historic buildings, including the LP Best House, built in 1894. Today, the Best House is the home of the Duplin County Veterans Memorial Museum. Inside, you'll find exhibits dedicated to veterans who were born in Duplin County or lived here at some point in their lives. The military plays a big part in Warsaw's identity. The town is home of the official North Carolina Veterans Day Parade, held every November. In fact, the parade is the oldest consecutive Veterans Day celebration in America. It's everything. It brings the entire county together in many uh, places from outside the county. It's a very long parade. Yeah, it, it's, it brings in a little commerce, but it's a fun day. We ask everybody to come, have dinner with us, uh, watch the parade, have the dinner, come to the museum. They have music around town. And so, yeah. It's a good, good day out. Warsaw actually observed its first Veterans Day in 1921, years before the holiday was formally recognized across the country. And we'll give you a more in-depth history of what the military means to Warsaw coming up in our next half hour. We're going to head about two blocks down Hill Street to the Duplin County Veterans Memorial Museum. That's coming up tonight at 530 in a brand new People and Places. That'll do it for now from here in Warsaw. Let's go back to the studio. Shayla.